Okay, so I was just uh, not actually recording for five minutes and talking to the camera. But um, hey everybody, uh, it's my fourth vlog now, which is crazy. Um, I didn't think I would get this far, honestly. I thought I was gonna stop at two <laughs> and not continue because I, I took a three week break for a while. I mean, obviously like it was Christmas time and there was a lot going on in general. So that's another reason why, but I got my third vlog up and I wasn't going to, but I did. And I actually feel like I'm back in it again and I can vlog more often. And I just have to remember to vlog parts of my day. That's one thing I struggle with. I don't know if anybody else who has started out with studio vlogs recently struggles with um, remembering to vlog, <laughs> um, just random stuff, especially stuff that like would be really good in a vlog and then you just completely forget to record it. That happens, that's happened to me a couple times now where like I'm doing something and it's like perfect for a vlog or a video and I just completely forget to record it. But um, now I'm trying to get better at that. Tomorrow is New Year's Eve, so that's my timeline right now. My hair looks a lot more red than when you last saw it, but it's just kind of fading into this like mauve color type of thing. I don't really mind it. Um, I used to not like red hair on myself, but I don't actually mind it that much, surprisingly. I don't know how long I'll keep it though, because I'm eventually going back to brown and then hopefully going to blue at some point again, which I've done before. Um, also shout out to my mom for getting me this sweatshirt for Christmas. It's really cozy and cute and I haven't seen this movie in actually a really long time. I need to watch it again, but it's also really sad. <laughs> so, um, yeah, but I really like it. It's cute. But anyways, this vlog is mainly just going to be about, um, talking about like New Year's goals and obviously I'll have drawing sequences. Um, as I just showed just now with me drawing my new Valentine's bears, I'm working on Valentine's merch early or trying to because um, with my Christmas stuff, it, they came late and I ended up not making as many sales as I wanted to. So I'm hoping because of having this time to like kind of chill and stuff, I'll have more time to draw Valentine's themed merch. Um, and also just Valentine's stuff in general, but um, yeah, so New Year's Eve is tomorrow. Um, I figured this would be a good time to talk about like New Year's goals and also just reflecting on 2020 and whatnot. Obviously for most of us, 2020 was crazy hectic and not great, but there was some good stuff um, for myself that I wanna talk about. Um, I went through a lot of like really bad heartache in the beginning of 2020, mainly the first half of 2020 up until like spring and summer. Um, was just a lot of bad, like in general, not even related to COVID really even at all. Um, and so I'm hoping that the beginning of this year is a lot better than, than this year, um, or of 2021. And also I want to hear your guys' positivity, like positive things that happened to you in 2020 as well. Um, for me, like the biggest one was obviously opening my Etsy store. I was pushing off opening an online store for a really long time. Um, for those of you who don't know me or haven't been following me for that long, I used to only do anime conventions or just conventions in general. I would do artist alleys and stuff, and that's how I sold my art. Um, and I have always done pretty well with that, so I didn't really like expand to online shops. I guess I was just kind of nervous or too scared to. Um, but a lot of people, you know asked me to or asked if I ever would and I had a good amount of people ask me if I would open an online store and of course with 2020 and COVID and everything that kind of pushed me to open an online store because I couldn't go to anime conventions anymore and I feel like that was like one good thing out of 2020 is that like it kind of forced me to sell my stuff online um and then I slowly realized it wasn't really that hard and I mean there's some hard things about it but it's not like impossible you know like it's not the worst thing in the world with you know shipping stuff and whatnot I, I don't know why but the shipping part of it kind of like turned me off because I've I've never really like shipped a lot of stuff before which is funny because like my parents sell stuff online for part of their living so it's like you think I would but like I don't so um that kind of intimidated me for a while but eventually um yeah, in April I opened my shop and it did really well in the beginning so it kind of pushed me to continue 
and I'm still continuing to this day. And like, there are times where like, I get a little scared that like, I'm not gonna do very well with like a certain shop update and stuff, which, you know, is normal for most artists, but um, most of the time I do pretty okay. So um, I'm not too worried about it anymore. It's still a little scary though, obviously. <laughs> this just makes it so much easier to vlog anything anywhere now. Um, also I wanted to show you guys my new switch case. Um, my husband got, or my husband Zach got it off Etsy for Christmas. It's really pretty. Um, I also have it for the controller and then I have it for my dock too, but it's not in here right now. <laughs> but yeah, I really like it. It's super pretty and nice. And this is my first Switch skin, so I'm really enjoying it a lot. Um, and now I'm going to villager hunt for a cute villager. I, there's not a specific one that I want necessarily. I'm not too picky about them, but um, there are ones that I find, you know, that I like more than others. I just realized this couch cushion <laughs> is like messed up. Okay, so I just got another really cute Christmas card from an artist friend, um, my artist friend named Tiny Plant. Um, she makes really cute art, like extremely cute art, especially her little strawberry bear character. And she sent me stickers with it, which are so cute. I think these are my first stickers from Tiny Plant, so I'm really excited and happy to get her cute little bear doodles. Oh my goodness, this sweater is so cute. <laughs> oh my gosh, and this one's like a little sticker sheet which is really adorable. I love the little strawberry milk. Thank you so much, Kiana. I love it so much. It's really cute. And I'm really happy that I have stickers from you. Just making a cute 
too to the other end. Trying out my tri tripod in a different area. <laughs> this is our living room. You see any clips, obviously, but this is honestly probably the best background in our house. Um, so I'll have to figure out if I should vlog, like, talking clips here or not. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm really sad because, like, our Christmas lights right there, um, half of them just went out. Uh, the first half went out a couple days ago, and then the second half went out, I think, yesterday or the day before, so we only have that little portion <laughs> right there left, which I'm really sad because it was giving us a lot of light in this room, which we don't get. So, we're just gonna have to toss them. I think we have another set of them. I love the icicle lights. I think they're so cute. But Christmas is almost over anyways, so... Getting a nap? Are you getting a nap? Ooh. Little bunny feet. <laughs> Are those your little bunny feet? And we got Goji sleeping. <laughs> Very sleepy kitties today. I just made a really sad little charcuterie board. It's a cute shark <laughs> I like it. Thank you. So it's almost the new year in like two minutes? Mm -hmm. Yeah, like two minutes. Yuzu. And we're still waiting for Animal Crossing. Yuzu Say says, hi to Yuzu. Happy New Year. <laughs> <laughs> Say hi, Yuzu. Say hi, Yuzu. <laughs> <laughs> We're watching the ball drop. Yay. 40 seconds, 43 seconds. Oh my goodness, we're already here. Here's the 2021. Yeah! <laughs> About to go off in the game. Oh my gosh. Yeah, it's like way ahead in the game. Mine's a little faster. There's a countdown! Yay! It's so Yay. cute. <laughs> I didn't get to do my popper. <laughs> I did the light stick. Oh, you did? I should have done the light stick. Mwah. Happy New Year! Happy New Year! He looks scared. <laughs> <laughs> Happy New Year, Yuzu. Come here, get your midnight kiss. <laughs> <laughs> Goji, come here and get yours. He's not going to. Yay, goodbye, 2020. Hey, goodbye, 2020.
soft boy. <laughs> okay, so I wish I recorded the process of me drawing this, but I keep forgetting to film myself drawing, so sorry about that, guys. Like, literally, once I start drawing, I just forget to film it. So hopefully I'll remember to do that next time. But this is going to be my last Valentine sticker design. Um, I'm gonna make the order tonight because it's already January, I believe, 13th. And so that means that Valentine's Day isn't exactly a month. And it takes me about two weeks to get my stickers in the mail once I order them. So I wanna have at least two weeks for you guys to be able to order Valentine's sticker stuff. Um, so this is gonna be my last sticker design. I didn't go ham on like drawing a bunch of stickers for Valentine's Day, even though like I realized that Valentine's Day merch has been one of my favorite things to draw so far, um, just because it, there's a lot of really cute things you can do with it. But I drew Curry the Tiger with a bunch of balloons, like heart balloons, and this will be probably a two inch sticker or a two and a half inch sticker. I'm no longer going to be doing three inch stickers for a while because I don't want to do massive stickers anymore. Or not massive, but like, I don't want all my stickers to be big so that they're easier to use in like journals and whatnot. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to send my order in for the stickers. I'm going to be doing this design and then I'm going to be ordering, if I can get it, uh, the sticker sheet design which I love so much. I'm really proud of this sticker sheet because there's a lot on it and I haven't done a sticker sheet with like a ton of stickers on it yet. So I'm really happy with this one. This one is actually, was originally gonna be a four by five sticker sheet, but I had made it a four by six because I added so much to it. Um, I wanna start doing more smaller sticker sheets, like four by five sticker sheets. But with this one, I just wanted to do so many different kinds of doodles. So it just ended up being a little bit bigger. Um, so I'm doing this sticker sheet, the curry sticker, and then this these stickers, which are going to be individual stickers, but I'm also going to sell them as a set. So you can buy them individually or you can buy them as a set, whatever is good with whatever people want. But yeah, so overall, if you count these as like individual stickers, I'll have four individual stickers and then a sticker sheet for Valentine's Day. And then this design I'm going to make into a thank you card. Hopefully really soon. It's what I need to work on next. I keep like putting it off for some reason. And then I'm going to be doing a restock of um, stuff that sold out uh, earlier in the year or around Christmas time. So yeah. Okay, so I always forget to record the unpackaging of stuff that I buy, but I just got the Lemon Bear um, plushie that Fuji B made. And oh my gosh, he's so cute and perfect. And his little tag, it's so adorable. He's like the perfect size. Um, I can like hold the bottom half of his body with my hand. Um, and I just love how big his head is and how small his legs and arms are. And he's super soft. Um, it's the perfect color of yellow. I'm just like obsessed, honestly. And I know that Fuji B is gonna come out with more bears. I think that they're making a strawberry one, a lavender one, and then a like fluffy brown bear one. And I'm super excited because I wanna get all of them <laughs> at some point. Um, yeah, you should check out Fuji B's shop. Um, they make super cute stuff. And like, how is this even real? <laughs> Oh my gosh. Oh yeah, and there's me in the background in the mirror. <laughs> Hi! Hello, you've reached the end of the vlog. Um, sorry this vlog has been so like, I don't know, random. Um, I didn't have a lot of clips this month and a lot of it was just New Year's time around <laughs> that I vlogged. I just haven't had the time to vlog or I just keep forgetting to. I'm still trying to get used to vlogging, but thank you guys so much for watching and supporting me. We're at 150 subs right now, which is crazy. Um, because the last time I made a vlog, I don't even think I was at 100 yet, so <laughs> that's awesome that people keep subscribing even while I'm not making videos. But I want to try uploading like at least every two weeks. That's my main goal for right now, because right now it seems that I keep uploading like every month. So I want to do, you know, vlogs faster than that. We'll see. 
but I'm having a fun time so far. Please ignore the background. It's very messy and like not very aesthetic. <laughs> I want to have more aesthetic backgrounds to like sit in front of or just nicer backgrounds with more plants. I actually have plants in this room. You just can't see them because they're on the other side, but yeah. Again, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next vlog. Bye!